it's a new segment it's deep talk with cows not every day i need to talk to you be with you i mean to each their own you know what i mean it's not going viral because people are like that it's going viral because they want to mock us oh by the way i don't do intros anymore like i don't say what i'm doing yeah let's not do intros anymore because intro is so long that like, basically we're just doing a mukbang and we're just talking mm. it's one of it's a new segment it's deep talk with cows and he's the first person and you're the first person bro the first person all right so i got a cheeky fanta for you thank you thank you can we deep i got him two fries because that's all he likes fries they're the only way to go if you have sense they're the only way to go i even have frozen ones as well but raw without cook okay I mean, to each their own, do you know what I mean? Mm. Mm -hmm. So, first is a catch up because we haven't seen each other in time, you know. Time. When's the last time we actually seen each other? It's March? actually it's been long. When in March? That time we went to the park. Was that the last time? We haven't seen each other since. You're lying. Oh, my whole life. You're lying. I'm not. You're lying. I forgot to get no pickles. But the generally, think about it. When's the last time we actually saw each other? The day where we went to the basketball court. That's the same day we went to the park. Is it? Mm -hmm. It was in March. Mm -hmm. Wow. And even so, that's when we filmed those um, TikToks that she never reposted. I never posted it. They were too bad. Me, I have, normally I have no shame, but <laughs> the, those TikToks were way too bad. <laughs> They were horrendous, isn't it? And if they went viral, it's not going viral because people are like that. It's going viral because they want to mock us. They want to attack us and bury us to the ground. <laughs> they were that bad. Actually, when I rewatched the video of us filming the TikToks, I realised how bad it was. You know, I'm even I'm debating removing that whole video because of it. What video? When we went to the park to film the TikToks. Oh, because you recorded behind the... Ah... Uh... I think it's best it deletes. It's only got 65 views anyways. It's never that deep. Yeah, I think... I don't know. You you can keep it. That's your that's your own problem. That's your own. <laughs> that's You're your in own. the video, so... <laughs> <laughs> but that's, that's on your channel. People will come for you because you're the one that was editing. That's your own, not me. Or, that's your own. <laughs> I don't even know why, like, what video we're doing. I just said, okay, I'm coming. I didn't even ask what video... I, on my way, I was just like, I didn't even ask her what video we're doing. But, you should, dog. I didn't even you ask. know that I don't plan these things. Mm -hmm. Okay, the first thing we're going to talk about is boundaries, right? So obviously, us two are very close, like very good friends. What boundaries do you think a girl best friend and a boy best friend should have? Oh, that's a good question. Mm. What boundaries should a girl and boy? I think this is one that mainly a lot of people kind of miss mm -hmm. because of their relationship with <clears throat> their girl or boy best friend, but privacy. Mm. privacy is key privacy is key i need my privacy mm -hmm. i really and so, you know some girls are quite they're quite clingy no disrespect they're quite clingy even if you're just friends they're quite clingy and i need my privacy i need you to just step back for one minute let me be let me be by myself but do you feel like what's it called they're always thinking you have to be there for them 24 7 type of thing when sometimes you need space mm yes mm. yeah as in my past like my past girl best friends they they've been you already know fam. yeah you already yeah. know they're crazy i have one now and i think that's i think that's a proper girl best friend like she respects privacy mental health mm. all that kind of stuff she takes all the boxes mm -hmm. but they i think they just they miss it when it comes to privacy like mm. and independence as well because it's not every day i need to talk to you be with you or something like that it's just it's mad i also feel like with um what's it called a boy best friend from my perspective right boundaries as in you have to make it clear it's not they can't lead to a relationship type of thing you know when you're being friends it's like friends you know what i mean mm. so like let's say for example right if I'm calling this fool, yeah? <laughs> so, 
<laughs> Sorry, facial expressions kill me all oh, day. <laughs> but let's say if I'm calling him, yeah, I wouldn't call him when I'm flipping, like, what's it called? When, do you know, like, if I'm wearing, like, a, like revealing stuff or something, yeah. I wouldn't call you then, do you know what I mean? If he calls, I'll answer the phone, I'll put it there, and I'll be like, bro, let me get dressed. Do you know what I mean? You always do that. You always. always. Cause I feel like there needs to be that boundary. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Because if you're doing that with your boy best friend, that no. means that's a potential boyfriend. You know mm. what I mean? What, 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 what? Tell them in them. It's like, you got to know that they're your best friend, like, in a type of sense. Mm. I don't know. Does, I, does I, that make sense? I, yeah, I agree. I actually agree. Mm. That, it makes sense. Another thing I want to touch on, speaking of boyfriends and girlfriends, yeah. Mm. Have you ever had a boy best friend where you how am i gonna say this let's say you like someone right you like this boy mm. has your boy best friend ever like has he ever felt a type of way about it what you mean a type of way what do you mean because you're because potentially you could have a man mm. and your boy best friend's there so imagine he's probably either going to be third wheeling or he's just you guys are probably not going to talk like you used to anymore because you're now close to you know mm. you know what i mean so what do you think about that i feel like what's it called i feel like in that situation let's say like yeah you're you're a boy best friend and girl best friend right one of you gets a man or a girl or whatever mm. gets into a relationship in that circumstance the other person that's not in a relationship needs to like understand do you know what i mean like obviously if if you need them and they're not there for you that's when they're fake that's when I'd say, yeah, it's a fake friend, you know what I mean? Like, let's say, for example, if... Let's say you got into a relationship, right? And then let's say, oh, me, my mental health is, like, declined, declined. I need to talk to you about it. But you, like... It's not even like you'll say, oh, I'll talk to you later about it. You'll say, I can't talk to you about it. Like, i got to go. i got things to do. Like, I don't have time for you. Mm. That's a fake friend, you know what I mean? But it's different if, like, let's say I call him and then he can't answer in that moment in time. It's fine because he's got a girl. You need to understand that he's got a girl. You need to understand that things have changed now. The dynamics change, you know what I mean? And also, when you see them, it's not even like you can do a hugging thing. It's more like a dap it up. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, literally, like, things will change, if that makes sense. That makes perfect sense. What do you think? I agree. The exact same thing. I agree. Mm. Like, imagine imagine someone saying, oh, what if... Um, what if I'm a better man or I'm, I'm a better girl for you? Imagine. And then they say it as a joke. It happens. I've it's, heard that's it. That's not a joke. It happens. That is not a joke. I ha- It happens, fam. I've heard it. It actually happens. I feel like, what's it called? If you know you've got feelings for them, and you know that, what's it called? Your feelings are going to intervene with that relationship. I don't know. Cut off the friendship. Do you know what I mean? The fact that some of them as well, they, they love to now flip the script mm. yeah they they flip the script and they say you know that man or do you know that girl that you're with they're bad they are bad do you know the things they're doing they will they'll try all the, they'll try everything and i'm telling you everything they can mm-hmm. to try and mess up your mindset so you won't be with that person anymore it happens because they're jealous and they only want you but they can't get you do you get what i mean precisely it happens. Exactly, exactly, exactly. So it's actually one of them ones where boundaries are so important in a friendship anyways. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Especially when I feel like also there's levels of friendship. Do you believe in levels of friendship? I believe that. Mm-hmm. I mean Wait, what do you wait, expand on it a little bit. So I feel like cool. There's some friends here that yeah I'd go out with them to town, yeah I'd go out with me. Yeah, we'll do this and that, yeah. But I wouldn't come to them if I'm upset. Oh, I wouldn't come to them if I have problems. Like, right, right, right. They're on that level of where we're, we're bands. It's nice, you know. I don't think we're going to be friends later on, but I'm enjoying the time now. Mm. Okay, yeah, okay, okay. I, I do believe that as well. Mm. Not everyone... And I think this is something that people need to understand as well. There's not every friend that you have, or even best friend, not even every best friend that you have will be the right best friend for you to talk to, if that makes sense. Mm-hmm. I think people always miss that, especially when it comes to boy and girl best friends. Mm-hmm. Because I don't I don't tell my girl best friend everything. I don't have to tell her everything. Sometimes it can be someone else that I can talk to about something. 
-hmm. And sometimes they're so mad, like, why do you tell me first? Why why didn't I know? You let this person here or that person there know, but you're not telling me. They get mad sometimes, but it's never the thing is it's never that deep. The fact that they've come and told you, why is it deep now? Mm. They're telling you now, like go exactly. over it. I have told some people some like deep ish stuff, not too deep, mm -hmm. right? But they're not my best friends. They're not even like we're friends. Don't get me wrong, mm -hmm. but they're not my best friends like that. But they know some things about me, which I kind of regret mm. to an extent because me, I don't regret things in life. The reason being is because whatever happens, we just grow from it and learn from it. Devin K on TikTok, come buy my food, don't spit in it. But the chips are mid. That's his name like that. Little man. Little man. <laughs> what are we talking about? <laughs> I don't even know. What's the what's the like what's the topic? I don't get musical guys. Like, I've fallen off. Oh, bye bye bye. Oh, do say